Surfers trying to catch some waves off the coast of Santa Cruz, California, now competing with an unlikely adversary, a sea otter, who's become infamous for biting boards and stealing surf. She's known as Otter 841, a five-year-old female who's been stalking surfers in this area for months. It was a cute encounter at first, which turned uh, aggressive real quick. June Young was surfing in the area when the seemingly harmless otter lunged at him. It made eye contact with me. It looked straight at me and my board. And before I was able to get far, it started attacking my surfboard. It was biting it off, just chewing it, tearing it apart. Parts of his board torn to shreds. <laughs> but was Otter 841 born to be wild? Sea otters in their domain, in the ocean, they are top predators in their environment. While experts from Monterey Bay Aquarium say this confrontational behavior is abnormal for the species, this otter's mother also has a checkered past. Her mom was rescued and rehabilitated and re-released by the aquarium. And then her mom had to be taken out of the wild because this sea otter's mom was fed by people. And, and that's a real problem. But Otter 841 was born in captivity and raised with strict protocols, so she would not be too familiar with humans. Our team that, that interact up close with them wear big welding masks and black ponchos. We call it the Darth Vader outfit. And, and that's intended so they don't think human shape is friendly. So marine experts don't know what's causing her to act out, but warn swimmers to steer clear from these tiny, but mighty creatures. I've heard a sea otter's bite is as strong as a black bear's bite. Is that true? Here's what I'll tell you. Our team, when we're handling otters up close, they, they wear Kevlar gloves. So it is, it is a strong bite. I wouldn't want to be near that mouth. So what's next for this infamous surfboard stealer? California Fish and Wildlife Services say they are working to safely capture and rehome the otter and then send her to Monterey Bay Aquarium for a health check. But as of now, this notorious otter is still out in the ocean in search of her next close encounter. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.